Yo, what's up YouTube? I hope all of you are having a great day so far. In today's upload, we are going to be going over the Street Sweeper. So ever since the Street Sweeper came out into Call of Duty, I've been getting lots of comments asking me to do it. I finally got around to actually unlocking and leveling it up. So today's video is going to be going over the Street Sweeper. And let's not waste any time. Let's get right into the class setup. So here is an overview of the class that we're using in today's video. So obviously the primary doesn't matter, but so for the loadout on the Street Sweeper. So right here, I think this is the best class for it. So for the barrel, you're going to want to run the Ranger Barrel just to increase that effect to damage range. It's nice when you don't really have to worry about the range of the enemy when you want to use your shotgun. So this Ranger Barrel is going to allow you to shoot people up to like medium range. What you could also do if you're trying to increase that fire rate, you could always do the Reinforce Heavy. But overall, I found myself doing a lot better with the Ranger. You could do the Task Force, but overall, it's always going to be like a two to three shot kill with this gun. And so I didn't really find a benefit of using the task force but if you want go ahead and try it i just think the ranger one is the one that you want to go with for the body to increase that hit fire accuracy you are going to want to use the swap F mw laser sight this is a very crucial attachment because as you guys can see it tightens up your hit fire accuracy we are losing some ads speed but you shouldn't really be aiming with this gun it really excels when you just run around the map and you just hit fire so that's why you want to run this laser for the magazine just to increase the ammo capacity since this thing does reload really quick you want to maximize the amount of bullets you have so that's why we're using the 18 round drum mag for the handle this one doesn't really matter I just threw on the speed tape because there is no cons. And I didn't really know what to do for the fourth attachment. The stock is very important, but the handle really isn't. So if you want, you could take off the handle and then you could add one of these muzzles. But overall, I just think the handle is better just so you have a decent ADS speed if you need ADS. And for the last attachment, you want to do the marathon stock. For some reason, it won't let me level up to level 35. I've done multiple games where I got it to level 35. I'd even leave. I just stayed in it, but it won't go up to level 35. So at the moment, I'm just doing the no stock because this is the second best thing. But just in general, the marathon stock is going to be way better. You get to move around the map really quick and you have a very high sprint of fire speed we are losing some hit fire accuracy but it is very worth it for that movement speed and we can just tighten up the hit fire accuracy with the swipe of mw laser sight and so i think that is going to wrap it up for the class setup i think my next striker video is going to be in hardcore just because you can really go off with this weapon in hardcore but so anyways if you do enjoy this video at any point i would really appreciate if you could hit that like button and if you're new to the channel and you want to get better at call of duty make sure you hit that subscribe button but without further ado let's get right into the gameplay but for some reason like the servers are down or something but like i just cannot find the game but as you guys can see we are using the street sweeper i know you guys have been asking for a while to do oh no not the ping not the ping please don't make me lag I, I think it's something with like the cold storm or something that like just no one's playing or something's messed up with the servers because i cannot find a game and i'm lagging but so anyway street sweeper very good weapon i maxed it out last night and so we should have a good time with it i want to oh my gosh no i want to make another video where i'm playing hardcore with it because on hardcore this thing's like stupid good and if i'm reverse boosting hardcore with this oh i could probably drop like a double nuke easy damn it okay so ping is really bad so i'm going to be behind the bullets so i think i just need to camp the sea house teammates have no idea what they're doing so this is going to be a little bit of a struggle to get over there but i think i can do it oh we did it there we go boys and we just got to run around up here we got the perk greet class on oh my gosh the lag hopefully it's a little bit harder for them to hit me because that'd be really funny i'm lagging with the shotgun no one can hit me well the reload on this thing is atrocious I'm gonna flip my shit. Oh my gosh. So I really want to buy a new router, but the router that I need to get to do everything that I want to do, like streaming and playing and have a good connection, it's like 530 bucks. So it's like, I don't really want to spend $500, but I might have to. But you know, it's probably going to be worth it. It's just, oh my gosh, 500 bucks for a freaking router. Well, they're all coming up here. These guys are really big campers. These are the people that you hate playing against, the ones that just sit up top on Nuketown. This is a lobby full of them. No, no. Oh my gosh, you're so bad. You're so bad. Okay, so let's try to get back over there. I'm just gonna try to rotate around the place. I wish the reload on this thing wasn't so slow. It makes sense that it is because this thing is pretty OP for a shotgun. It seems like it's usually like a three shot kill. And so it's honestly not too bad. It's just this reload. Oh, okay, they're all over A. I should be able to get a couple of them. This thing holds 18 rounds. That's insane. Oh boys, we're actually affiliated on Twitch if you did not know. Oh my gosh. So the time you're seeing this is actually after my first stream being affiliated, just because I record my videos before I go stream and then the video goes up the next day. This lag is pissing me off. Oh my gosh. But so anyways, because of you guys, I am affiliated on Twitch. And so you should stop by the stream and see how it looks. It's exactly the same. Nothing's different. I can just receive like subs and stuff, but it's just pretty cool though. So thank you guys so much for that. I really, really do appreciate it. Now we're just on our road to being partner. Oh my gosh, this lag. Okay, I just need to focus up and get in the enemy house. This thing is so fun. Dude, let me go up the stairs. Dude, I think I need to disable the Wi-Fi on my phone.
There we go. Look at that range. This thing's crazy range. Oh my gosh. Especially with that fire rate tied into it. It's insane. Look at that. This is such a struggle to get over there. Oh my gosh. I can't tell if it's just like my internet because it's never this bad. Or if it's like just because of the winter storm and like something with the connections is off across the states or something like that. Okay boys, this round we're just gonna go full try hard. Even with the lag, we're just gonna go full try hard. We're gonna camp the house. We're gonna see how long of a streak that we can go on with the lag. I'd use half a mag for one person. That, that, that's okay, that's okay. Dude, this thing actually jerks around your aim. I didn't even know about that. I was running around and it literally jerks you around the place. Like, I know it affects your aim assist and stuff like that, but this thing literally jerks you around. Like, your aim. Like, I can't even look right. You see this? What the fuck? Sorry to make this video about lag, but I guarantee you guys have never seen lag like this. Like, I can't even look left or right. Look at this. Dude, it's skipping and I'm just holding right with my analog stick. No way. I didn't know lag could do this. Okay, let's actually go try hard, though. Okay guys, I honestly, I don't think I can play today. Like I literally can't play. Hopefully I can stream. Um, so I think I'm just gonna wrap up the video here. Sorry, it's a shorter one. I will try to do another striker video where I'm actually having a good connection, but like I just can't get a game with a good connection. And so I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Hope all of you have a great rest of your day. So anyways, uh, thank you guys for everything and I will see you in my next video. Oh my God.